To install the Adobe Reader to your computer, the first thing you'll want to do is open up your web browser and go to www.adobe.com. Once the web page loads, if you look over toward the right hand side of the page, you'll see a link which says Get Adobe Reader. So you want to click on that link and this is going to bring you to the Adobe Reader download page. And you'll see here at the top it says download the latest version of Adobe Reader and if you scroll down you'll also see the option to install the free McAfee Security Scan Plus software. You want to uncheck this. You don't want to install this because this might actually interfere with your current security configuration. So make sure that's unchecked and then click on the download button toward the bottom of the screen. Now, Internet Explorer may pop up and say this website wants to install the following add-on, Adobe DLM. What you want to do is you want to click on that little bar at the top and then select install this add-on for all users on this computer. So click on that link and then give it a second and it's going to start installing the software that it needs to download the program. So here you go, you're going to get the Internet Explorer security warning. So click the install button and this is going to install the download manager and the download manager is going to take care of everything else along the way. So the download manager is going to load and you're going to see a screen that looks something similar to this. Now this download process could take a while, so please be patient. Once the download is approximately 80 to 90 percent complete, you see a little window pop up that says please wait while Windows configures Adobe Reader. At this point, the Adobe Reader software is communicating with your computer and is installing itself not only within your computer, but within your web browser as well. This will come in real handy in your online course because your instructor may provide lectures and other materials in PDF format. And these PDF documents will be loaded by the Adobe Reader and from there you can print them or do whatever you need to do with them. One of the nice things about the PDF format is that it does put documents in a very easy to print, easy to use format. So once the download and installation is complete, you'll see a notification that says Adobe Reader installation complete. And once you see this, you can click on the close download manager link and you're done.